Uh, in today's video, hi guys, welcome back again to Uncut with Uju. My name is Uju. Thank you so much for clicking on my video. So in today's video, I want to quickly react on Prempe College. You guys, I made a video where I talked about Prempe International Airport, Kumasi, and that video went viral. I got a lot of people, like mostly even some African countries, like people from different countries wanted to see more of Prempe. You know, what do they have? They want to see the hospitals. They want to see the schools. They want to see the, you know, a lot because on more, that video choke. So I grabbed on this school. And the reason why I decided to film this school, I'm making such research on Opukuwari school. This school popped up as well. I was like, no wonder people want to see. No wonder people want to see more of this prempe. It's like there's something happening. Ha, you guys. I also went on the news and I found that this that this particular school has won so many awards international locally. So I'm going to quickly insert videos for that so that you guys will see what this school has done for themselves. Like these guys are on the map. Prempe school is one of the best schools, a category school in Ghana. First thing for this school is actually um established by let me not see the word owned let me know is the word owned, so people will not drag me in the comment section established by the methodist church and presbyterian church in ghana all boys school boarding school a category um you guys ages from i think 16 to uh you know these guys are stars like these guys are literally stars that that, that break they, 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 they are making things work like oh more i saw the school i was I opened my mouth like this, like I could not, I could not ha wrap my hand around it. One of the things that attracted me to this school is the fact that these schools are free. I don't know if you guys understand my grammar. I'm sweating. The weather is hot. <laughs> these schools are free. That's one of the things that attracted me to this school because with the equipped laboratory, equipped sick bay, dormitories, classrooms, well-skilled teachers, like, oh, wow, government of Ghana. Ghanaians, appreciate your own. The earlier you guys do that, the better. Your government is doing. I know, I know, I know, I know. African leaders, they still have a long way to go. But so far, so good. He's the best. He's the best. And you guys have to appreciate him. Okay? Let me quickly show you guys what this Prempe school looks like and how it has impacted the citizens, the indigenous, the indigenous, the citizens, the indigenous of Ghana and how it has also helped to promote Ghanaian's economy. You are going to be shocked. So keep watching this video. Let's react on it and be back. So let's quickly take a look at Prempe College. So this is one of the most requested video on this page because I already made a video talking about the new reconstructed um airport prempe kumasi international airport and people wanted to see more of prempe you see when i tell you guys that ghana is on the map when i tell you guys that africans like mostly west africans are interested in what is happening in ghana see you guys if you don't talk about ghana then what are you talking about okay these guys have a lot of amazing things to talk about i shared with you guys what the airport looks like and a lot of people want to see more they want to see the schools they want to see the hospitals and i got you guys covered as always so in today's video i want to quickly talk about the Prempe college it's a public secondary boarding school for boys located in kumasi the capital of the Ashanti region, Ghana. So this school was founded in 1949 by the Ashanti men, traditional authority, the British co colonial government, the Methodist Church Ghana, and the Presbyterian Church of Ghana. Just like, or should I use the word, unlike Opuku Ware School that was founded by the Catholic. This one is founded by the Methodist Church Ghana and the Presbyterian Church of Ghana. So this school is named after the King Ashanti, um, you know, who donated the land of on which the school was built and was modeled on Eton College in England. You guys, like I said before, this is the all boys school, age 15 to 19 years, strictly boys, you know, and their motto is character and integrity. This school topped matriculation at the Kwame Krumah University of science and technology in 2004 with 441 students admitted and in 2012 with 296 students from the college admitted 
this school has won so many awards you guys literally i don't know if i'm capping but this school is great you guys there's just newly the one they just won newly which i'm going to insert the pictures and videos for you guys to see the school has won the national robotic championships a record five times between 2013 and 2021 and they just won one of recent okay i read it and i, I fell so much in love with this Prampe School. So Prampe College won the Toyota Innovation Award at the International Rubber Fest World Championships held in USA. In the early 1940s, the British colonial government invited the Presbyterian and Methodist churches, which had already established schools in the southern zone based on their experience, to help set up a school in the middle belt of Ghana to serve the northern sector of the country. Although there were so many delays due to the Second World War, Prempe College was designed in 1948 by British modernists. In summary, the college was expected to produce scientists and technocrats who could play vital roles in the economy of the Gold Coast. At the same opening ceremony, Prempe outlined his expectation by, for Prempe College, the hope that the students of college would shine not only in the intellectual field, but also in the moral firmament. So I know a lot of people might be wondering, how does this school benefit Ghanaians and ghana as a whole and as always with the other schools it's a stem school you know and you guys know how equipped stem schools are in ghana aside the fact that these schools are free <clears throat> i love everything about them i love the fact that they have skilled highly skilled teachers that have the interest of ghanaians at heart i love the fact that their laboratories are well equipped these guys where we as in, there is this new project that was introduced one person one tablet and of course Prempe school was not left out so these guys are computer literate they pave way for the for the economy okay all Ghanaians like you can't tell me when some one of the major reasons why a lot of people are out of school is because of funds and when these schools are being made free for them what do you expect it makes a lot of people like a whole lot of people be able to afford this school because it is free except if you have problem with going to school which nobody you don't have to blame the government for it okay as aside other most of african countries don't have what Ghanaians have you know Ghanaians you guys are blessed because what you guys are benefiting from your government is worth talking about and this particular school has actually brought a lot of you know development to the country people come from different countries just to benefit from this free education okay it has you know made a lot of people mostly west africa short sure, generally the world talk about ghana because as equipped and as modernized these schools are with the standard of education a lot of people would want to benefit from this and this helps to increase revenue for the government promote the economy so thank you so much to the government of ghana for being thoughtful for being intentional about equipping schools in ghana making sure that these children are not out of school because once you're out of school of course your future is ruined let us in the comment section were you opportunity to attend prempe school did you attend opuku school let me know the school you attended in the comment section and i'm going to go to that school and dig out the school for you guys as always it's your baby girl uju if you've watched up until now, let me know your thoughts in the comments. Which school did you attend? Did you attend Opukuware? Did you attend Prempe? Did you attend Holy Child? If you're a girl watching, what are your thoughts about Catholic schools, Presbyterian schools, Methodist schools? Let me know your journey thoughts in the comments. These schools are owned by government and they are doing so well. Hi, mama. My baby is here in case if you guys can hear her voice here. We are doing content together, right? So let me know your thoughts in the comments. If you're yet to subscribe to the channel, please click on the subscribe button. Part of this family. And I hope you and I know that you enjoy watching. So